Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in once again. Today I have an exciting video. We're gonna be doing a pack with me video as I get ready, as I am leaving in a couple of days to go traveling. I'm running a little bit behind, but I managed to get my packing down to a science to ensure that I cover all of my basic needs while I'm away, to ensure that I have a comfortable stay when I'm at my new home away from home for the week. And maybe you'll even find some things that I pack that you didn't even think of. I definitely traveled a lot I don't like overpacking and having way too much stuff. It's just kind of annoying to carry so much stuff around. So I've managed to lock it down to the basic essentials. So we are going to get into it today. So thank you once again for tuning in. Hit that subscribe and let's get started. So I'm going to share with you guys what I pack. All right, so let's take a look here. This is my makeup, hair, medicine, and everything in between that I'll need on my vacation. So let's get into it. Okay, first up, let's check out our essential kit. So some essentials are a hairbrush, some clips. You can pick up these mini squeezy bottles from the dollar store. These can hold your aloe vera, your shampoos, your conditioners, things like that. So these are absolutely great. And these were like a dollar, so that's amazing. Deodorant, of course. Your toothbrush and toothpaste. I have individually wrapped makeup wipes, so I can take them if I'm going on an excursion overnight somewhere. So these are great for removing dirt and makeup. I also love traveling with some wet hand towels. Because I like to travel with miniature products, I love this by Away. This is Detox Shampoo, so it gets out all that tangled ocean hair. So that one is absolutely amazing. And then along with the Way leave-in conditioner for afterwards. And some other essentials that I'm bringing are definitely sunscreen, some eye drops for those dry eyes, and some Q-tips. So for makeup, I don't get too carried away because I am on vacation and I don't wanna have to do a full face of makeup every day. So I pack very light with some versatile pieces. I carry this Glamingo palette set by Violet Voss. This is your bronzers, your highlighters, your blushes. You can also use these as eyeshadows. These are absolutely great, it has the mirror as well. So that's also nice when you're on vacation. Just love carrying that as my main staple piece. And then I also got this four in one brush from Amazon that I'm going to be taking along with me as well. This has the top piece there for foundation, your blending brush there, your big fluffy brush for your blush and bronzer, and again an eyeshadow brush. Also taking along a chapstick, some very affordable foundation by She Glam. This was like 10 bucks from Sheen, along with a beauty blender. Some miniature concealer by Tarte. Definitely check out my traveling with miniature makeup video where I feature all of my favorite makeup products in tiny size. So definitely check that one out. And I also carry along with me my favorite lip liner and lip gloss. This duo together from Fashion Nova is absolutely amazing. I'm wearing it right now. It just really makes your lips pop, especially with the clear nude color on top. It really makes your lips look fuller and really pretty and stay glossy and hydrated the whole day. Along with some eyeliner and mascara as well. This one is from Amazon. This was called L'Oreal Panorama Mascara and the brush is just so big, giving you those super nice flawless lashes. This is also waterproof. And that is it for makeup. Next essentials are for your ladies. So the strapless bra from Sheen. This bra is so versatile. It's the only all-in-one bra that you'll ever need. This has straps, or you can remove the straps to make it a strapless bra. You can remove the back piece, make it tighter, however you want to wear it. It's got like a corset and then a push-up bra here. So I love bringing this bra with me. This is my one and only bra that I love traveling with. So highly recommend and like 20 bucks. I'm also bringing along those nipple pasties, those adhesive bras. These are absolutely great. I have worn these like a hundred times. They literally are just stickers for your chest. They are waterproof, sweatproof. They stay on tried, true, and tested. So I love bringing these. That boob tape for those backless shirts that you can't wear a bra with. My favorite pairs of sunglasses from Dickley. This brand is absolutely amazing. It offers UV 400 protection and they're just so stylish and they were like $29. So honestly, like if you lose them, it's not a big deal. I don't like to travel with designer sunglasses because if they get lost in the ocean, like that would suck. <laughs> so these are absolutely great. And the hair tool that I love traveling with is from Amazon. This is her styler. This is the best wand I've ever used. You can get curls 
instantly and they last for days. This is such a beautiful wand. It's got a 360 swivel cord there. It comes with a glove so you don't burn yourself. The wand is nice and big. If you have really thick hair like me, it's super easy to use, beginner friendly. So definitely traveling with this wand. Which leads me to my next item. This is a universal charger. Well, you just simply plug in your hair straightener, hair curler, whatever you're trying to use, phone charger in there, and it will work with any type of plug. So here's the UK plug, for example. I love traveling with some music, so I'm definitely taking along my AirPods, some charging cords, and Apple AirTags, so I always know where my luggage is. Passport, of course, some gum for the plane and a book. So those are my traveling essentials that I bring with me. I pack four pairs of super versatile shoes. Okay guys, so here is what I bring to make sure that I look fashionable and that I'm comfortable when I am on vacation. I don't like any clothing that's too restricting. I like my clothing to be nice and stretchy because again, I'm on vacation and I want to eat everything that I want to eat. There's no judgment, there's no rules. So first piece, what I'm wearing here is a super comfortable. This is the outfit that I wear to the airport. And when I land at my destination, this is comfortable. And of course, because it's still snowing outside, I can't just show up to the airport in flip flops and a dress. So I am wearing some Keds. These are super great slip on shoes. They're so comfortable. They're great for running around the airport, great for the plane. I know some planes are like freezing and it's nice to be wearing shoes on the plane because sometimes it's really cold. And if you're wearing open toed shoes, sometimes it's freezing. I'm wearing a strapless, comfortable tube dress. This one's really cute, it has the slit. This is actually from Sheen. And then I just have a jean jacket on top just for warmth. And if it's also breezy, it's nice to just have a jacket of some sort. So I just think this pairs nicely together for the weather here, transitioning to the hot weather there. So this is piece number one. Next outfit is the exact same tube dress, just in the color red. And again, pairing it with the jean jacket. Maybe this could be for when I leave at the end of the seven days and head back. Love these tube dresses from Sheen. They're just so stretchy. They offer lots of comfort and warmth because they do go pretty far down to your ankles or you can scrunch it up. So it's super comfortable for the airplane because let's face it, planes are just not comfortable. <laughs> and I just, yeah, I just think this one is so cute and versatile and you can wear it so many different places. This dress right here from Sheen is so stunning with the slit leg, how cute. And these heels from our Deans. Oh my goodness, what an outfit piece, you guys. This is really cute for going to dinner while you're traveling. It's just super comfortable, stretchy, breezy. Oh my goodness, this is definitely one of my favorite pieces that I'm gonna be bringing. Next up, I am in love with this dress from Sheen. I have it in the pink as well. This is just a nice stretchy dress. It's so good. If you wanna go on an excursion or a walk on the beach, you just wear that strapless bra from Sheen that I just mentioned, and it's got the lap kind of here really cute style again love the stretchiness love the little bottom as well this one can also be dressed up with a pair of heels or just shoes whatever you like i just absolutely love this one and my secret traveling essential is this boob tape this is from sheen it is absolutely incredible you get so much all you have to do is rip off a piece of this tape and for those occasions when you cannot wear a strapless bra or those nipple pasty then boob tape is for you. You just use a couple pieces of the tape and I will show you guys a side that is done and taped up and a side that is not. So you can take a wild guess here. <laughs> it is really good for wearing for any of those outfits that you cannot wear a strapless bra with. Again, this one is backless, so I could not wear a strapless bra with it. And the nipple covers would have just still, wouldn't have corrected the sagginess. So I highly recommend picking up some of this boob tape. It is like 
gold in your suitcase. So definitely highly recommend. How beautiful is this dress from Sheen? I love it. Again, you don't have to wear a bra with it. You can just wear those nipple pasty covers. I just think this dress is so cute. It just ties up around the neck. I actually got it in white and black, but I think white is just more of a pop of fun color for traveling against the backdrop of tropical trees and palm trees. I love this one. It is curve friendly, stretchy, and does not hurt your neck at all. So I highly recommend this one. And it can be paired with sandals, flip-flops, heels, so super versatile piece. So I bring about three different pairs of shorts when I travel. These ones are super cute, comfortable, and they go with these one-piece bodysuits from Sheen, which are super cute that I'm wearing with the strapless bra as well. These are super comfortable. They're stretchy. I love the V-neck detail and they just look so good. So let's go ahead and try them on with some shorts. Okay, I'm absolutely obsessed with these shorts. They look so cute. I love the duo tone, the white short, half white short, half jean short. I just think these are super cute. Again, I am wearing them with these sunglasses from Amazon. These look just like the Ray-Bans, but they're not. They're like one tenth of the price. And they even have the little signature in the corner there. Forgive my nails. I have to get my nails done tomorrow before my trip. Got my nails did. Yeah, I just absolutely love them. They're super cute. I have them in the greenish color as well. I just find these ones super cute as well. They're more reflective and such a cool beachy color, that aqua green. These shorts were from Sheen and they are so curve friendly appropriate. I like to be comfortable in my jean shorts, especially in a hot climate. I don't want them rubbing and causing any digging. I was in Vegas and I was wearing such tight shorts. I was miserable. I had to go back to the hotel and change. So not this time, not on this trip. So absolutely love these shorts from Sheen. And the next ones I'm wearing as well are from Sheen too. Okay, so same bodysuit top, just in white. And this is the second pair I got from Sheen. Now these are a little bit more cheeky. They have just the little peekaboo of the bum, but I just find them super Super cute along with these flat sandals how adorable are these these are like the Paris ones these are absolutely adorable I think these were like ten dollars or something ridiculous they're so comfortable and true to size and I just think it pairs well so nicely together just super simple way to travel and pack so again yeah I hope you guys like this outfit as well I absolutely love this cutout dress. This is from Sheen. I am not wearing any bra with it. I'm actually wearing some nipple pasty covers. These are adhesive, super sticky. I love the box. It's like magnetic. So you just keep your nipple pasty covers in there. <laughs> Guys, how cute is this bathing suit? This is from Fashion Nova. I love the cutout. I love the twist tie top. You can tighten it as much as you like. It has adjustable straps. This one is just so cute. I love one pieces that make me feel so comfortable and secure. You can also pair it with this fabric skirt with the cutout. This is from Timu and it's just a cover up wrap skirt. It is one size fits all. It is so nice and stretchy and just really comfortable for leaving your room and walking down to the beach and feeling nice and covered up. So this is really versatile. It works with so many different colors and types of bathing suits. So definitely pick that one up. I love this bathing suit so much. I actually got it in black as well. This one is totally giving me Baywatch vibes, the running on the beach scene. How pretty is this one? Again, I love the pop cutout here. This is from Fashion Nova as well. I swear my favorite bathing suits are from Fashion Nova. They're affordable and very comfortable with the built-in padding. I also got this mesh tank top cover up from Sheen and this was like $10. It is so cute, just goes over your bathing suit just like that. It's got the little drawstring there so you feel nice and covered up going to and from the beach. So highly recommend picking one of these up as well. And for those days you have a really bad sunburn on your neck and you don't want to wear a bathing suit with straps, then definitely check out a strapless bikini. These are so cute. This one is high-waisted, has that ruffle detail. 
This was actually from our Deans, like $10. So highly recommend this one. It's just so comfortable. You're nice and held in. So no slippage or anything like that's gonna happen. So I highly recommend this one, especially for the tummy control. Just feels really, really comfortable. I love this one. And I love a great white bikini for every day. This one is so nice. It's just super comfortable. It was like $10 on Timu. Highly recommend. It's very comfortable, nice and stretchy. Even has padding in the chest as well. And this one looks absolutely great paired with that cover up skirt. So definitely a versatile piece that you can wear with everything. Here are some more bathing suits that I also packed. I know you guys are gonna love these ones just as much as I do. They're super nice and affordable from Timu, Fashion Nova, and Sheen. You cannot go wrong with these bathing suits. It's such a great price, all under $20. So this year I'm actually traveling with a giant checked in suitcase as well. And in here is just toys and gifts for the staff members at the resort that I am staying at. I love putting together gift bags and it just makes me feel so good to give back and bringing them some items that they may not have in the areas where they live. So I love tipping cash as well as leaving a gift bag every single day for the staff that takes such good care of us when we're there. So let's go ahead and check out what I've packed for them. I love packing little gift bags for every day that I'm there. So in this case, I'm there for seven days. So I've packed everything from hygienic supplies to batteries, to kids toys, to cleaning supplies, to some of those Stanley looking mugs to keep their drinks nice and cool. Hair supplies to Sephora samples. I don't know about you guys, but I, my Sephora samples, I've collected like hundreds over time. So I've packed them all individually amongst all of these. Um, so yeah, I am just so thrilled to give all of these super cute gifts away um, every day for the staff members. I know they're going to love them and appreciate them, but definitely highly recommend um, bringing some gifts or tipping your hotel staff. You can also check online to see what area you're going to, what kind of supplies that they are in need of. So that's what I have done. And I've packed every single gift bag absolutely full to the brim. So I've got to pack these in my suitcase now. So let's go ahead and do that. And that's it for my video today, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I think I have everything I need packed for the trip, but you never really know until you're there. These are my essentials. I hope that you found this video really informative and maybe gave you some ideas of what to bring as well that you didn't think of before. Thank you once again. Hit that subscribe if you haven't already. And I can't wait to see you guys on the next one after I'm back from my trip. Bye for now.